Hi, uh, Hugh Elliott. I'm just uh, working on, not working on, but I, I worked on my displacer code for um, uh, the show on August 11th with displacer Michael Morton. Uh, he's going on at 11 o'clock uh, p.m. I hope to see everybody there. I've uh, put together this little presentation. You see here I've got the Boyd and, Wa uh, well, another Boyd, and then Waveform Renderer with three pretty simple uh, libraries I've been able to put together, and then some adjustments, of course. I've been able to put together my little piece. So I'm going to run the code. We'll talk a little bit about it. Okay, so what you're hearing in the crackling is actually I'm running as a line in. I'm running Displacer's Night Gallery. You see it's Phantom Limb is the first track. And uh, see it's running pretty well. It's lightly painting. So I have here is using Touch OSC. I have some controls. I'm going to just increase the opacity so you can see what's really being drawn. So what I'm doing is I'm following a wandering sprite, or Boyd in this case, Daniel Schiffman's excellent wander code and followers code, and then adjusting based off of uh, FFT get band. I'm uh, painting to the, I want to call it a canvas, but it's not, whatever the processing version of the canvas or the stage is. So the other thing I've allowed myself to have is the uh, ability to just changing tracks obviously the ability to control the X and Y of what they're following so I want them to paint primarily down in the bottom in the left hand corner so I've just dragged it down there and you can see them start to converge in that one area I'm gonna move them over here this is a new track so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna save the print and just start a new drawing so they're all converging in that one spot I can just drag around and they start to converge. Now if I hit wander again, they're going to get back to wandering around. So now that I've done a, a pretty hefty painting, I'm going to change the opacity back so it turns out that they're much, much lighter. And what I'm actually painting are uh, prints. So I'll show you what, I'm, what I mean here once I find it. So what I'm actually grabbing for each song is an image, okay? And then each image is being painted. And then when I hit save print, that loads a new image and the image that was painted is saved here. So Mike will have prints based off of his entire show. So anyways, we're super stoked. Uh, met with Mike yesterday, Displacer, and uh, we went over it. Really excited. Uh, can't wait to see what happens. Uh, playing with Touch OSC and an XML socket server, or a socket server in general, and uh, just some pretty, pretty pictures. Okay, bye.